what's up guys this is Zach from PvP District uh, I'm gonna show you guys some feature about the server speak about stuff <coughs> and I'm gonna show you how to actually freaking use Talony correctly so first of all you guys find a really good emplacement for your base like this house I just built it's really bad but it's only for showing you guys how to use Talony uh, your presser is F9 so you get a double tap F9 so you will see chunk size this is by default it's 16 by 16 okay so I'm gonna say one thing before starting okay you see this door here if you actually put it on the edge of the chunk like that people will be able to open it so don't freaking put them there okay please you gotta put them here and you need to use uh, if you want to put pressure plate you gotta use those one because if, if <laughs> If you use the uh, wood one, then you can drop stuff and then it will open the door. So use the stone one please and do not put your door on the edge of the chunk if you did not claim this chunk here. So basically how to actually claim an area. It's really quite simple. You gotta go inside let's not go like let's you gotta go in your chunk location like here and do slash uh you gotta do blue 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 T space new space town and then uh, no, T, new, and then chose a name. Uh, I've set one here, so mine was like. I already belong to a town, but you're supposed to be slash T space new space, put the name that you want. And it's important to stay in the chunk that you want to start your base. This chunk here is going to be the primary chunk of your base location, okay? And you cannot go far away and then decide to chunk here, uh, I mean, to um, claim this chunk here, okay? So you get a ch you get a claim all around your primary chunk. This is how it's go. So in order to claim other chunk, you use slash t claim. But I did claim this one here, so it's pretty simple. One more thing: before claiming, you gotta put coins in your storage. By the way, when you're gonna create your town, it's gonna cost you 250 coins. After that, it's 10 coins by day to actually give you uh, protection. So you gotta pay 10 coins for 24 hours. Uh, claim protection okay so people that are inactive or leaving the server uh, when their storage is gonna run out of coins people will actually be able to loot their base so this is one of the best reason we're actually using townie because if inactive player leaving then you know you can actually take their stuff uh, let's speak about one thing before I, I'm gonna continue with townie uh, you know this is a PvP server I know that a lot of you guys have been complaining about getting steel and other stuff but you gotta understand this is a full PvP server uh, you can steal kill on site spam kill knife back destroy base destroy like a hundred of hours of life spawn in this game uh, it can do what you want okay this is PvP so we won't drop you guys anymore back your item if you're getting steel or, or, or raid starting now because I'm making this video to help you in order to actually make this place as safer as possible as you can so okay let's keep it up so how can you store money in your bank it's quite simple you're gonna do slash T deposit without an E without an E it's important and then you put a number let's say thousand boom just deposit a, a thousand coin in my bank so now I'm like good for like a hundred day <laughs> Um, yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. Okay, one thing that you guys need to freaking set up, and I heard so much complain about it. This is this command here, okay? That is the permission for outsider, okay? And this is like the key of reading. If you don't set this off, you're fuck in the butt. Because what will happen is, outsider will be able to open your door, open your chest, and just fuck your base. They won't be able to break stuff too, but you don't want to get still like that. So you gotta set it to off and press enter. Mine is already off. Uh, it's outside won't it be able to open door anymore. So that is how you actually do that. One more thing, you gotta set the PvP off in your town. Well, you don't need to, but it's better. It's really better because you know what? When you set the PvP off in your base. People won't be able to kill you in your base, but you will be able to kill outsider in your base. That is a funny fact. Uh, pe when somebody die on <laughs> on a climb zone, they, they can't get their the grave back, you know. So yeah. So in order to toggle off the PvP, you do slash town toggle then PvP. But I I I've did it, so it's gonna enable it for me. 
but uh, yeah, you do that, and it's gonna disable it for the first time you type it. Um, if you want to see Homonic Town, there is in the server right now, and remember, the server is about eight day alive yet now, so it's a pretty fresh server. We have, we've got so many people. Thank you guys for joining. You slash town list, and this is the number of town that we got at the moment. Um, there's other feature that I want to show you, uh, really simple. We banned a lot of, a lot of grief item, I think, so fucking pig. So this is he XD, this is from, yeah, you know what, you, you know from who it is. Um, when you're in base, there's something awesome that I actually wanted to speak about. We've been working on this, it's really awesome. Um, the freaking rice cake. Okay, so example that you actually want to, let's say... Have a player shop in this spawn. What you want to do is do I do I, do I need to bring my fucking iron or stuff like that to the spawn every time? No, 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 no. You put your chest here like that, okay? And what you're gonna do is you know pin it. Let's say you put only one rice cake in it. You're gonna take redstone. Redstone is your best friend. You left click it and then you slash warp shop. That's gonna bring you to the uh, admin shop, but it's free because the uh, player shop is right next to it. So let's say you wanna claim this one. It said three weeks, but we're gonna switch it to two. It's a thousand coin for two weeks, okay? You right click it, get inside. We're using old case, but you don't need this. You actually only need a uh, sign. You can actually just set uh, a shit ton of sign everywhere, and that will be fine. So you set a, you set a sign, and you're gonna do this just like that, okay? Uh, G. Buy, let's say uh, we said uh, rice cake. The, qu the let's say one, and then the price. I'm gonna say this. So then you left click it again, and then boom. You, remember, you gotta left click the chest first. It's important, otherwise it's gonna destroy the sign. And then when it's blue, it's because there's a rice cake in your. Um, oh my god, I said rice cake. <laughs> It's if, when it's blue, it's because there's a uh, rice cake in your chest, and you, it's fine. People can actually buy it, but when it's out of stock, then it's turned red. So I'm just gonna do slash back. But the reason why you actually wanna put one in the beginning is that's gonna set your chest to only sell one at a time. And when it's done, you're gonna buy it first. Okay, when it's done, you can put as many as you want in the chest. It doesn't matter. Like, let's put two, two stack. Let's say slash back and then you can actually your overstuck it uh, that's weird it's supposed to work ah I hate my life okay you know what I'm done <laughs> okay let's just redo it because it's supposed to work I think I actually need only one chest, that's the reason. So let's put one here. Redstone. Um we said you not G by Oh There we go. Say so one Price left click boom There we go now you can buy it now there's no more you slash back and you can actually put as much as you want as the post works now hey, there we go <laughs> okay so remember do not put double chest cause it won't work I just I just figured it I just saw that so it's only one chest and you fill it of anything you want okay there's one thing uh, people could actually be able to scan with this shop I mean like I'm gonna give you a really cool example I'm gonna set one sign here and say that's <laughs> G by Dragon Heart one and let's say three K, why not? And in this chest I'm gonna put a uh, freaking fig cheeks. Okay. And then you left click and then you left click and you right click. And it's gonna cost you three K and you will receive a freaking juice. Okay. So that's the thing that people could actually do that for three K. If we caught anybody doing scam like that, you will be banned from the server for weeks. And your player shop will be removed. Okay, so hopefully you guys won't do shit like that. Because it's really gay. But I um, just wanted to tell you uh, that, yeah, yeah, we, we don't allow people to scam order like that. 
But uh, yeah, this is mostly all of the feature that I wanted to show you. Uh, right now, uh, we're building a lot of new stuff. That's gonna be freaking awesome coming up. Got like uh, Hunger Game new events. We're gonna have like some like Treasure Hunter events. Um, we're, gonna, we're actually building a giant uh, arena for doing 1v1 and betting system where you can actually say I'm, I'm betting 100 coins on this guy if you win then I'm gonna get 200 it's you double the size of the betting you're actually betting so um, yeah make sure to don't miss those new content we're actually working pretty hard on that and thank you guys for joining PvP district I really like that it's been less than a week now and we got like 40 members so far and it keep raising up so this is amazing uh, <coughs> You know, there's <laughs> this one thing that you guys can actually do too. I think some people don't actually you know. Can do slash shop, and that's gonna show you the actual shop, the website shop. You can do um, donation like that, or buy any freaking donator kit or large kit or anything you guys want. And you know what? If you guys want to subscribe, it's really cheap. It's two dollars for two weeks, and actually that's gonna help us a lot. If you guys actually wanna help out, help us, help us out. <laughs> <laughs> helping us with the server so uh, thank you for watching this video hopefully uh, you guys will know how to um, build your town in a safer way if you guys got any question I'm gonna link uh, in the description a website link with all the actual Tony command so it will be easy for you to figure out but uh, what I've show you is the basics of Tony if you, you if you know that you're fine okay so uh, thank you guys for watching this video and uh, I'm gonna see you guys in game.